What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? It's your boy Kevin to turn on this motherfucking YouTube shit. What's up? What's up? What's up? It's your boy. Kevin teach y'all on this YouTube shit. Hey man, say man, we are lit, eh? Lead them up with the tease, man. Turn up, 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 turn up. Today? It's a motherfucking day. Straight hood, north side, big crib, man. Hey man, say man, turn, 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 in the hood, north side, crib, man. Hey man, say man. Hey man. They said they looking for your boy, man. Hey man, say man. It's dangerous out here, man. It's getting real spooky out here, man. You dig what I'm saying? Make sure y'all like and subscribe to the videos up, man. Kevin and 2 Chain gonna be uh, safe out here, man. Make sure y'all like and subscribe to the videos up, man. I'm stopping with God, man. Make sure y'all like and subscribe to the videos up, man. And yes, get it. Hey, man, say, man, we out here for the one time, one time in the north side, man. In the slums, man. Big crib. I'm on the lookout, you know what I'm saying? Gotta be prepared. So we can stay prepared, so we're gonna get prepared. So we gotta look around and, sh and shit, see who's looking around. But hey, man, say, man. So, you know what I'm saying? Uh, today, man, y'all know how we were talking about Boosie and T.I., man. You know what I'm saying? All this shit started over um, T.I. and Boosie's sons, man. They sons were acting a goofball and doing crazy shit. And they people already, like, you know what I'm saying, already got it. And they trying to act out gangster and shit. And it's like, bruh. You did. The family already got all of it. You know what I'm saying? So it is weird. That whole bunch of shit just kept on going on. Then it's about um. Then it's about um. Uh, Gabrielle Union's kids. You know what I'm saying? Her kid was also weird shit. You know what I'm saying? They had changed the gender and shit. You know what I'm saying? That I don't agree with. But you know what I'm saying? That's people and that's their family and their life. So they gotta do with the, whatever they got to deal with. Type shit. But then it was like um. Boosie's own daughter was on some extra shit too. You know what I'm saying? So that kind of calmed down what happened. Boosie's daughter was on the other side, kind of shit. You know what I'm saying? That was wild. So you feel me? A lot of shit been going on. Then, um, so what What all happened about this is T.I. was making a joke about him snitching and shit. You know what I'm saying? And you know, on Crime Stoppers, you know, T.I. was the, the spokesman. That nigga was the spokesman. That nigga was the, the that nigga was the costume. That, you know how Chick-fil-A got the, the hat, got the, the cow suit? Well, he was the rat suit. You know what I'm saying? He had the whole suit on, bitch. You know what I'm saying? He was like, call, call, um, crime stoppers, man, type shit. He even said this shit, man, you know, um, and, you know, the black community, they kind of forgave him and shit, you know? I'm keeping it real, you did. They kept, they kind of forgave that nigga, you know what I'm saying? They wasn't really tripping, you know what I'm saying? But, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, the kids started acting all crazy. And it's, it's like, bruh, your dad out your, your dad been out your business, you know what I'm saying? And he, you know what I'm saying? His gun charges and all this other stupid shit. So, now he was talking about, T.I. did this to himself. Nobody was even talking about this, um, this damn, um, you know what I'm saying? He found him, uh, his best friend dying. Ain't lying about what, what he found on his dead homies and shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he did this shit, like, to be goop, like, funny and shit. Like, bro, at this type of time, nigga, this not, that's not the, the time to be funny about some, some shit like that. Lying on your dead homie, that's not funny. The fuck we talking about? <laughs> the fuck we talking about? You know what I'm saying? And then, um... And then everybody was just freaking out because we was like, bro, you just said you just snitched on your home, on your on your dead homie. I don't think your dead homie was in your ear telling you, don't snitch, don't snitch on me, playboy. You know what I'm saying? Just like, and even if it was, I don't think I would just be like, you would say snitch on type shit. So, you know what I'm saying? Everybody was bugging the fuck out. Like, we like, T.I., we ain't believe nothing the fuck you saying, T.I. You know what I'm saying? You know, T.I. been on so many fucking movies and shit and everything. We just don't believe that nigga like that. <laughs> So, um, so Boosie called him out. He said, man, I don't give a fuck who it is. 
if you read it, you said anything, you, you, you snitched to the motherfucking nurse, bitch, you snitched to the motherfucking, um, the, uh, the, the office aide, that's a snitch, you snitch, you know what I'm saying, so he was just saying, he ain't fucking with snitches and shit, because like, you know what I'm saying, he had to stand on business, so you know what I'm saying, we all like, yeah, boozy, yeah, you right, bruh, if, if, if they nigga, cause I was already with the shit anyway, but you know what I'm saying, be like, real yeah, bro, this nigga's a snitch, we ain't finna go on, follow, just go with that shit, you know what I'm saying, but, uh, so you know, everybody was just like, yeah, and then, uh, so then, I guess, T.I. got mad, he was like, oh, go, 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 I said, I, I was making a joke, and we got the paperwork, and this and that and that, whoop, 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 if you got something to say, if you got something to say, pull up. I got the paperwork party. Pull up. Like, bruh. You know what I'm saying? You done done this whole dumbass situation. No one ain't trying to kill us. About anything. You know what I'm saying? And you out here just making a joke about you snitching on your dead homie and shit. That's wild shit. You know what I'm saying? So we always like, we always mad at that nigga. Because it's like, bruh, you tripping, man. And people pulled up too. You know what I'm saying? In, a, in an area and shit. And then, um... You know, after, after that, you know, T.I. was still trying to come out and shit, trying to, you know what I'm saying, do a little few things in the chair. But then, you know what I'm saying, I guess, you know, you know how behind the scenes, you know what I'm saying, you talk to people and shit, and you start realizing that they sound like best friends type shit. You know what I'm saying, they best friends and shit. And that, um, they grew up together. You know what I'm saying, that's what people are basically saying. You know, T.I., you know, King and, and um, motherfucking, um, Tootie, you know what I'm saying, Tootie Raw, they was all, yeah, I'm saying, they were all best friends from the beginning. I feel like they did that whole shit because King got his dumb ass jumped and shit in, in, in high school. Beat his, beat the, the, beat the jelly out of his head, you know what I'm saying? He was trying to act all tough and hard. And I guess he was trying to get some cool points while getting in trouble with that little driving thing. But he's like, oh yeah, it would be the driving, not that bad if you get a ticket, bro. You just, that's your first ticket, but bitch, come on, bro. So it's like wild shit, like, you know what I'm saying? So I guess, you know what I'm saying, then Boosie came on Vlad TV. You know what I'm saying? He came on Vlad TV. He was like, he was like, um, uh, he was like, yeah, man, we done met up. We seen it too, you know what I'm saying? They met up. And they, I guess they apologized. He was like, yeah, man, I done met up with, uh, with T.I. And, and I don't apologize because, you know what I'm saying? He done helped me out in, in my whole time. And, and he um and uh he helped me reach so much success and shit. But you know I'm a real nigga, so I'm gonna have to call it out. You know what I'm saying? Like you know what I'm saying? Boosie be on some real nigga shit too. But it's like, like you said, bro. I understand too, man. If that's your business, if that's your homie, and your homie is the one snitching, you know what I'm saying? It's tough. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, damn. You feel me? So it's like, but 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 the way. Boosie, like you was saying, he was saying, man, if you snitch, man, you stand on business, man, we ain't, man, we can't, we can't chill together. But then I guess they chill together, because I don't know if Boosie, if T.I. had the proof that he didn't snitch, but he did, he did it to Crime Stopper. So it's like, you know what I'm saying, he still be on some, on some other shit type shit. So then we like, so basically, I'm just looking at Boosie like, bro, so y'all, y'all still gonna do this, this tape together? And everything, but then it's like this video came out about um Boosie. He was in a chicken and waffle house, and I think it was like four um people tried to run down this nigga, bro, with a gun and shit, bro. You know, at the end of the day, man, we we barely got these celebrities or people in the in the, in the first place, man. You know what I'm saying? It's like we can't really just hold these motherfuckers to fire. Nobody's perfect. You know what I'm saying? Everybody make mistakes and shit. So it's like we ain't no use to put holding the motherfuckers to the fire. But at the end of the day, man. We still can say what our, what our mind is, what, what's the mind. We don't have to go to the next level, you know what I'm saying? But we can always keep our mind and be like, hey, Boosie, we still be on that. We still don't trust Tip. Because, you know what I'm saying, he, he might be working with the feds. But, hey, if anything go down with you and they try to lock you up, bro, that's between y'all, you know what I'm saying? It's like, just don't be, just don't, just don't let T.I. inform it on any anybody else type shit, you know what I'm saying? That, may, that nigga might inform me on the whole motherfucking rap game. You dig what I'm saying? So it's like, <laughs> he might be the biggest rat. Ugly uh, glass. 
You dig what I'm saying? So it's like, bro, we got, we got, we got, we got, we got, we just got to hold these motherfuckers accountable. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, because they hold us accountable. They hold, they hold, they hold, they hold everybody else accountable. So if y'all getting us killed out here or locked up, bro, you know what I'm saying? We just got to, you know what I'm saying? We got to hold people accountable, man. It's like, but we all just trying to get it at the end of the day, man. We all just trying to make an extra buck, get that guala, you know what I'm saying? Get that motherfucking uh, chochos, you know what I'm saying? But it's like, when motherfuckers see that motherfuckers trying to get it, you know, motherfuckers try to, try to put salt on the game. You dig it? So it's like, we can't let motherfuckers like that put salt on the game and shit. Because he already done got it. You know what I'm saying? He, he already got it for his family. You dig what I'm saying? So he's like, he already got he already got it for his family. It's like, so he can't keep, it's like. It's like, bro, can't, um. It's like, bro. He already got it. Can you, can, you, can you let somebody else get it while you trying to snitch on them? You know what I'm saying? So that's like, that's all we trying to ask T.I. Can you let other motherfuckers make it while you trying to threaten or, you know what I'm saying, you snitch on them? You feel me? It's like, damn, bro. It's like, you already got the shit, bro. Your family already winning it. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? You already got it. Somebody might throw dirt on your name, nigga. Who gives a fuck, bro? It's like, bro. You know what I'm saying? Let other niggas make it type shit. You feel me? So it's, it's just weird. You know what I'm saying? But Boosie, man, you got yeah. That's on you, Boosie. So if you if you rocking with him, you rocking with him. But hey, you know what I'm saying? Cause some of his, some of his songs I like. Uh, he, uh, but he got one with Young Dolph and shit. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? But it's like, bro, it's just man. We just can't keep on letting motherfuckers like this keep on ruining the fucking culture with this with this, with this type of shit right here, bro. And as they use on mainstream social media to talk some shit, man. So we just gotta keep a watch out, man. Make sure y'all like and subscribe to the videos up, man. Kevin two turn option for the one time, one time, man. We gonna keep on talking that real deal spiel, man. And yeah, man, I glad Boosty get I glad Boosty get blasted on Instagram live, man. Um, at the Chicken Waffle House, you know what I'm saying? Because Nigga had a, a, a part of his head, head ass nigga. He had a whole part of his head. And he was so worried about the part. He wasn't really worried about the people who were trying to blast on him. So it's like, you know, he already got blasted on before that Big T's LeVar in Texas, man. Hey, man, it's Texas, man. Now it's all right, bro. So make sure y'all just stay watch on the watch out, you know what I'm saying? Never know who's spying, watching, waiting for a nigga to slip up, cause, you know what I'm saying? Niggas do be on that type of time and, You know what I'm saying They wait for any chance or opportunity To just say y'all can't give it to me So it's like we all got to still in our motherfucking mind You dig People are always waiting for a nigga downfall So we just can't fall for the motherfucking The, the setup because They want a nigga down now You dig It's like Of course they like They amazed that they wonder Like damn this nigga really doing it out here Nigga really making it but at the same time, be like, they niggas still be like, but hey, man, I'm still that, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, bro, you know what I'm saying? I'm still that, I'm a hood nigga too, so it's like, hey, man, you know what I'm saying? Talk, I'm talking about my motherfucking shit, so it's like, hey, you dig? It's just like, bro, I, when you grind so hard and you put that work in, you really what that north side big creep, you know what I'm saying? Shit happen like that, you know what I'm saying? Because I've been doing this since I was a little kid type shit. So you know what I'm saying? Of course, it's just going to translate into the, to the, like, to a grand, bigger space because, you know what I'm saying? Just off the strength of me. You know what I'm saying? Off the strength of me. Kevin Two Turn, you know what I'm saying? It's just gonna happen like that. You know what I'm saying? And, and you know what I'm saying? I give all thanks to Yahweh, God above. You know what I'm saying? So it's like everything working out in, in the way it's supposed to be. And it's just like, we just gotta keep on going, you know? Keep on doing our thing. Cause at the end of the day, if we down out, bro, we, 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 our leg halfway broken. Remember, nobody gonna help us out. We just gotta keep on getting it. You dig? So it's like, each day I put in that hard work strength just to like try to just keep it going and stay on top and do my thing, man. Keep on trying to get higher, bro. So fuck with your boyhood and also be crib, man. And it's tough on the street. Just stay on the watch out and don't trust nobody but God. Hey, man, man. Make sure you like subscribe after this game. Hey, Dad, you know that when we need to talk about this shit be legendary. You know this is instrumental. You the engineer on it, so pull that everywhere.